Hey everyone, welcome back and thanks for joining me. I've been bodybuilding for as long as I can remember. And there was a point in time when I was all legs and no upper body. And one of the body parts I had the biggest problem with was my back. And my experience too, that is also one of the hardest body parts for people to build and work on. It's one of the most neglected ones as well. People like to focus on the ones that they can see. People like to focus on their chest or their shoulders or their arms, um, even their legs. And if you turn, <laughs> you can see your butt in the mirror. In my opinion, it's always good to look coming and walking away. It is very common for adults to have back pain. Studies have shown that weightlifting may be safe and can in fact help relieve pain when done correctly and for the right conditions. Obviously, it's a really good idea if you do have back pain to check with your doctor first if you do any physical activity. Here are three tips on how to get a better back workout. Tip number one, when training any body part, there are pressure points you can use in order to help you achieve the best possible result from the exercises you choose. Biomechanically, your body works in a particular way. So when you're training the back, it's best to pull from the peaky side of your hand. Keep all the way in the bottom part of your hand and row, okay? You don't want to pull from the top of your hand or into the side of your hand. If you do that, you're going to be focused more on doing a bicep curl as opposed to focusing on your back. Reach all the way out, pull from the bottom side of your hand and squeeze, pulling from here. To further reiterate my point, Pulling from the pinky side of your hand can be used from almost all back exercises, from pull downs to T-bar rows to underhand rows. Focus on pulling from the pinky side of your hand. Tip number two, focus on the muscle mind connection. Your back can be one of the hardest body parts to train because you have to go through your arms in order to get to your back. It can be very easy to end up just pulling from your arms and not using your back at all. I recommend squeezing and holding each rep for three seconds with your back, not your arms. People tend to squeeze the bar really hard with their hands and focus just on holding onto the bar instead of squeezing their back muscles and focusing on that. Another trick is to have someone touch the area that you're training. It will help you focus on the part of the muscle you're working and if you're doing rows, you can have someone place their fingers in between your shoulder blades. This way, you have something to focus on when you're squeezing for each rep. Every time you squeeze, you'll feel those fingers there. You'll be able to hold the rep and it will help blood rush into the muscle and help to make you feel that connection and help with that muscle-mind connection. Tip number three, learn how to use straps when you're training your back. Place them on your wrists like this. Have the strap pointing toward your thumb. See how the strap goes toward my thumb, not away. You want to wrap the bar on the opposite side of your hand. My hand's on this side of the bar, the strap is on this side. So this is right, this is wrong. Right, <laughs> wrong. So once the strap is on the opposite side of my hand. Then I'm going to take it, I'm going to wrap it around, and then I'm going to squeeze it nice and tight. Once you're set and doing the exercise, you're going to be way more focused on doing the movement than just trying to hold on to the bar. Now don't use straps on every set, just the heavier ones so you can focus on the movement. You don't want to get too reliant on these. Over the years, I've seen way too many people with really developed arms and no back muscles at all. Every time they train back, they end up using their arms and not their back. Don't let back become bicep day. I hope that these three tips will help you develop a much more solid back. Now, if you like this post and the content that I've been making, please hit the like button share this post and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for taking the time to check this out. You guys have a great day. Bye.